Hi friends, today tutorial I am going to teach you how to create this kind of two-tone staircase and a steel staircase like this. You can see this kind of staircases are very useful for your housing project or any other commercial projects. So I am going to teach you how to you how to create this kind of two staircases using Revit in 10 minutes. So first of all I'm going to open a new project go to file go to new and I'm going to change the template to architectural template and click OK okay now I'm going to create a flow so go to flow and create a rectangular flow here like this click ok and go to 3d view you can see like this go to level 1 now I'm going to create a staircase go to stair in properties you can see three type of staircase assembled stair cast in place stair and precast stair i'm going to create that steel staircase first so i'm going to select this assembled stair and i'm going to draw it like this click ok go to 3d view i can see the staircase like this i'm going to change graphic display options uh here the style i'm going to change it to realistic and the smooth lines click apply so the staircase it can be like the staircase can see like this so i'm going to change this staircase to that steel staircase you have seen previously so select this staircase and go to edit type I just need to change some settings here I'm not going to change any calculation rule settings I'm going to change the settings of construction here there is there I can change the run type settings so go to here and you can change the run type properties from here I think you know what is thread and riser mean so first of all I don't want this riser here so I untick this and click apply you can see that riser has disappeared so now I want to change the thread here I'm going to change the thickness of thread to 30 millimeter and the nosing length it can be 25 millimeter nose in profile i'm going to change 30 millimeter and click, click apply you can see it changed accordingly now i'm going to change the thread material go to here and okay i want to create a new material rename it to walnut so walnut and now, now i'm going to import that material from here walnut search the material and import it to your material click apply click ok click apply the material has changed for the thread now click ok now i want to change the support so what i can i what i want to do is i am going i want to change this support settings so here write support i want to change it to carriage open and the offset 
I'm going to change it to 200 millimeter. Same way, I'm going to change the left support and now everything is fine all the settings have applied and you can see the steel stack is what we want now i'm going to teach you how to create that two-tone stack is go to level one go to stair i will create a stair case but i want to change it to monolithic stair so i can draw like this i can change the steps like this and click ok go to 3d view monolithic stair can be see like this so i want to change the properties of this stair case select the stair case go to edit type now I'm going to change this staircase to two-tone staircase. So I want to again I want to change the construction settings. So go to run type and click here and I can change the properties of the runs from here. First of all, I want to add thread click apply you can see the thread also I want to add the nose nose nosing length um, I have changed to 25 millimeter and also nosing profile I'm going to change it to 30 millimeter as well as I'm going to change the thread thickness to 30 so click apply everything has changed accordingly now I just want to change the material of this thread and this uh, concrete. So thread material I am going to change walnut. We can type it walnut. We have created that material. So I can just try type the material name. So it has changed. So I don't like this concrete material. So I'm going to change the monolithic material something white so search white and I am going to select gypsum wallboard material double click it and apply okay click ok click apply click ok see everything has changed this is the two-tone stag is but the material of this landing has not changed accordingly so select this stack is again and go to edit type and uh, right go to landing type and here you can change the monolithic material of this landing search white yeah gypsum wall board double click it click ok click apply click ok right everything has changed accordingly so this is the way i am i have created this steel staircase and this two-tone staircase right same like this so you can download the, these two types of staircases that Revit project from my Patreon. The link is in this video description. If you have anything to learn about Revit or AutoCAD, you can suggest some topics. So in 10 minutes i have teached you about these two staircases how to create these two staircases using revit